I've been here, came here from Brazil, arrived here 2003, been here since. My first job was at Dunkin' Donuts, worked there for 12 years. Then I got a job in Bat Israel Dickness in Plymouth, worked there for five and a half years as a housekeeper. COVID hit, I had to leave the job. I have two young children. So I had the time to pursue my um, education, my adult education. Of course, never know English, never been to an ESL class. That was difficult, but I conquer, of course. A year and a half out of work, my director that I used to work for as a housekeeper called me and offered me a job as an operation manager in Falmouth Hospital. A year later, as an operation manager in Falmouth, I was offered a position as assistant director in Morna Hospital. 37 housekeepers that uh, report to me when I took my first high set test, I failed. So the week after, I repeated the test, the high set test of math, and I passed. I give the credit to the professors, they were amazing. I knew that would not be the end. They had the, the program of transitioning adult education to college. The transition program, it was the bridge to connect um, both worlds to me. I was offered a four, four classes or two semesters uh, classes for free. It's a motivation for you to, to keep going. Working 65 hours a week, have three children at home, a husband, so it's not, but I'm getting there. I decide to keep going my own. That's when I earned the 2023 President Merit Scholarship. And that reminds me, me, my kids, and whoever is around me that they're gonna hear that uh, hard work pays off. My future goals, I usually pick steps by steps. So my next one, I will become the director. It can be more in hospital, it can be another hospital. Even though if I did not have have the help that I have now, I will still choose in Bristol Community College.